if you can't use for whatever reason the pre-compiled version of uh, Meerkat for Windows, you'd come to python.org, you'd download Python uh, for Windows. Now I'm going to download uh, 3.8 just because I'm running Windows 7. Uh, you can't use the default ones. Uh, note uh, 3.8. So we launch the installer. I'm going to go ahead and check uh, add Python to path because it's uh, useful for a few ways to make it easier to run. And go ahead and install. All right, and it's on setup. And then we go ahead and close this. Now Python is installed. All right, uh, now since we have Python installed, let's go and do the easy way to install uh, Meerkat. Just pip install Meerkat. Uh, pip should come with uh, this routine. Okay, so uh, comes with Python. You notice that it only installed Pi USB. This is actually because uh, the default Meerkat library is actually only uh, the code and the uh, the USB. So we can actually do something like Meerkat minus ZC uh, E. Uh, Rita control there, and then it will pop up a uh, a Rita control dialog, and this actually is all you need to do to run a uh, Rita control. Uh, okay, and let me go ahead and install everything we actually need to run proper Meerkat fully. So that's pip install Meerkat all. Now this will install all the dependencies, not just the thing, but uh, easy DXF, pillow, uh, OpenCV for the camera, and uh, WX Python. Most uh, all of these are optional. You can see that it runs perfectly fine with only the default of uh, just the Pi USB, which lets it talk to the uh, libUSB driver. Uh, the Windows driver, uh, if you're only using the Windows driver, you don't even actually need that because it'll just uh, communicate through window. And then from here, we type in Meerkat and it should launch. All right, so this is all good, but we sort of want a uh, a desktop icon or, you know, something that we can run from the desktop. So let's go ahead and do that. We do a new, just gonna do a quickie text document. Uh, let's go ahead and edit this really fast. Okay, and then I'm gonna tell it Meerkat. Save. Now I'm going to rename this to mk.bat. Yes, go ahead and change it. Okay, now when I run this, it'll load up one of these and then do this. And uh, we can load up uh, here, jog around with the laser. And you can see in uh, controller that it uh, went ahead and connected. Okay, and so that's all you actually need to install Meerkat in a pretty short period of time. Uh, you can also download the source code itself from the uh, from the GitHub, which is probably an easier way to do this. But if you uh, install this way, you can. Uh, run some of the later version stuff, uh, run sort of bleeding edge, 
but you can also uh, avoid any uh, false positive virus issues. All right. Uh, thanks for watching.